Situated in the northern part of Rift Valley, Samburu County is endowed with a variety of natural sceneries like plateau, escarpments, valley, wildlife to mention but a few. Insecurity through cattle rustling is one of the key challenges facing the county. Caritas Maralal, through the Catholic Justice and Peace Office, is one of the key actors promoting peace and reconciliation efforts in the county. God gave us the Ministry of Reconciliation. We have to reconcile the people with God and the people among themselves. In the Samburu National Park, after three months of my ordination, a lioness adopted a baby, gazelle. And for two weeks, she was going around with this gazelle. A sign of God. They can make the impossible things to become possible. If a lion stay with a gazelle, why can't a Samburu stay with a Tulkan and a Bokot? As people of God, as a church, we believe that is a priority now, to talk about solidarity and peace and forgiveness. And as a practical thing, there is uh, this uh, campaign of sensitizing the people, speaking every, every time about this issue of peace and so on and so on. We uh, organize our Caritas office and uh, we sensitize the people, the Christians, the children of the school and so on, with this new mentality that we are part of the people of God, we are part of Kenya, and Kenya has got a variety of tribes, 42, and we have to stay together. Caritas Mararal is the social, humanitarian and development arm of the Catholic Church and in this case, uh, Diocese of Mararal. The vision for Caritas Mararal uh, is to promote a transformative society where people enjoy their rights and coexist harmoniously. Uh, Caritas Mararal has a strategic plan and in the strategic plan it's outlined the strategic pillars which are five. The first strategic pillar is justice mm -hmm. and peace. Uh, this is a conflict area with a lot of uh, insecurity. Uh, the other pillar is about access to basic services which we deal with health facilities, uh, promotion of human health. The other one is uh, disaster management. Then uh, the last one is in terms of uh, organizational development. The Diocese of Marara. Justice and Peace is the priority because people cannot go, uh, do any other development work without peace. So peace is our priority number one. When uh, Bishop Pante took over from uh, Bishop of uh, Marsabit, we the Caritas were mandated to spearhead this mission of reconciling. First, uh, since the adults were not talking to each other, so we said our entry point is children because they were able to speak to the heart of their parents. And they, we, we, we engaged the, the children to have a pen pal relationship. <laughs> Peace and reconciliation. This is the state of state of harmony. State of what? State of harmony. Why do you think that it's important to have peace in our area? It brings people together. It brings people? We lost many of our relatives because of lack of this peace, peace in the area. And when the war broke out, what happened? They lost their life and belongings. Yes. People lost their land. People lost their land? Yes. yes. This peace club, one of the paramount importance is that it brought our neighbors, that's the Pakot and the Samburus together. They were able to form friendship. These children were from this from these various communities were able to to interact. Right now as we speak, many of them have friends from the neighboring schools, that's the from the Pakot side. They have friends 
and they do even communicate. They do even send gifts to their colleagues or to their friends due to this peace. We established a peace committee from the Samburu side and the, two, and the Pokot side. The peace committees now became now a bridge between the communities to talk, to recover or lost animals, to do kind of reconciliation when there is a conflict and to stop uh, uh, any escalation of conflict. Mi na unganicha wa vijana wa Pokoto na ya wa Samburu. Sababu sisi tumepikana, anapika hata wengi, watu wa kufe, anapeleka mali ya wengine. Hiyo vita ame effect mimi kabisa. Sababu inaona hii ndiyo nini ya risasi ya mepika mimi hapa, hakatogesha. Kijia na ingine ya, ya sister yangu, hame uawa juu ya hiyo fita. Tena ngombe yangu, hameenda. Kari taseme kuja, hame pitia kuangu. Taka sema, sisi nataka kusaidia nyinyi. Kama hiko namba ya wenzenu, pikia wenzenu simu, alafu uite, upatane hii kama watu tano, alafu usugumse. Sisi tunakuja kusaidia nyinyi na sisi tunatua gari kuenda kukutana na pokot. Akapea mimi kredit ya miya moja, akapikia hiyo wa pokot, alafu sisi warani ya wasamburu kayanda. Karetas, akasaidia sisi kushinjia sisi ngombe mbili. Ndume, anatoka upande ya wa pokot, ndume ingine, anatoka upande ya wasamburu. Kila watu anagopa wengine, kila watu tu anatetemega, tumoyongea, 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 mbaka amani tumepata hata saisi tu mtoto tu anaenda kushunga hata mtu inalala tu mzuri warani tu anaenda kushunga kari za tunarichia asante sana sababu inaenda mbaka ndani ya kijiji women also played a critical role in promoting peace and reconciliation in lulu sub location caritas have changed the mind of the community uh, we usually have three groups Every group will bring their own information what had happened in certain, in certain village or in a certain center or in a certain location. Since to lishukua jukumu kama wa mama, since to lianda amaya, to kasema ni rasima to ongelesha watoto wetu, to onyesha ubaya ya fita. Na tulipo sugumusa hivyo, kwanzea wakati yon baka saa hii, mungu ametusaidia amani hiko. Saa tunafuraia kabisa. We also have a practical example here of the goats that we have just recovered from the rastalas themselves, people have stolen them. These goats belong to the Pokot, they are 12 in number, and uh, we are intending to give them to their owners during a market day. So it's a very good initiative from the peace group, uh, Moroja Integrated Peace Group, in a, and their collaboration between them and the Morans. It's a combination of all the people, the Morans of Samburu and the Pokot, and also of the Turkana. From the peace committee, we targeted the people whom we thought were the one who was behind conflict. And one of our best examples was uh, uh, counselor by that time, Mr. Lodungo Kiyok. He used to be controversial. When the Pokot were uh, attacking his community and his community were crying, he felt with them. And sometimes what he did, he could even spearhead uh, and organize group to respond, not on a positive, but even to go and attack. And this man, uh, also suffered as a person. And it was the same, same Pokot who shot him, who killed his own son while on the mission of uh, peace building. And now he's one of the best uh, uh, peace builder in the county. In fact, uh, as we speak now, he's the chairperson of uh, uh, district peace committee. Kitu alikuja kupata sisi, ampaya o, hati jawai sisi kuona kitu naitua kifo, mutu kuwa mungine. Lakini aliasa kama mcheso, kuibana mbusi, mwampe kidoko, Masamburu akapika aka pokota akakata mkono. Elifurukana tu, kimucheso kwa soko. Siku hiyo ndiyo moto eliasa alo iborungare, akayenda mbaka laikipi. Tena abiganu wa usiku yote, watoto hakuna siku wapana kufa. Fijana ya mwampe. Sirika ni nai, haka. Teka endelea, teka endelea kama mihaka mbili, tatu. Hakuna pokota na onkea masamburu. Ataki kusiki. Unduki tu, watu umekua kama shifta. Hata ikuona wa mama, hakuna mutu na oka. Hakuna hata kusaa, watoto. Yani, hiyo miyagayata, hakuna mtoto kidogo. Watu hiko mstuni. 
sasa mwezi mwaka ya nne Mungu sijui ilipitia wapi kanisa akasanyika akasa kuita wasai kidogo naenda kwao na huko akasukumuswa tutafanya nini sisi samburu peke yako tikashinjiwa ngombe tutakusukumusa tutafanyaje na pokoto uwi watu wataki pokoto sasa tutaambiana nini sababu kuona huyu unakumbuka ile mtu yako aliouawa na ile ngombe yako umeenda na ile usuri ulikuwa anakaa kufanya na ni huyu tu ndiye alifanya mimi nikae hivi kakarita sasa tupeleka mpaka na nyuki wa pokoto karibu 20 Masiyo shirini na tano, mashirini. Nika sukumusa, kusukumusa, kusukumusa. Siku mpili, siku ya tatu. Sisi naonesha pitu. Hai, 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 hai. Ile manino yote likuwa masawu wakaruti. Wakati sina kutana subuhi. Kwa workshop, wakuna mutu. Kela mutu anasama tuende tefanyi. Yero tefanyi nini tifati ya mani. Tetapikisha hii manino aje. Yaani kila mtu ameuzika ime, baka anataka kwenda kumwambia watu yake. Now motivated more than ever with a change of heart as a peace ambassador, his next mission would have been the last. Mimi kikimbia hapa sababu siku hiyo mimi ni kasula. Kibiga hapa mbele. Mbele ya ngombe mimi na tuangu ya risasi. Toto. Hapa. Hapa yote ilikuliwa. Lisa sitano alienda kutolewa uamba. Na nilikuwa naendesha gari na bunduki bande hii. Sasa iko kijana yangu kubwa hapa. Yeye alitwangwa. Alafu mimi nabigwa hapo tena. Mimi sijakupa hapo. Naendesha gari kutoka hapo mpaka Longewa na hii mko. Mimi nashika tu nikaendesha gari yangu na kufungua chai tiki na futa ina endesha na leta bunduki yangu hapa bas mimi napita yana yangu kubwa meanda wase karibu watu tano li ilipikwa machara lakini mmoja alikuwa siku hiyo mimi napikia hii watu simu yangu sasa msicharibu kwenda pokoa hapa nalipisha kisasi basha Mungu anilipishie kisasi na kusema kweli risasi ile nyamasa kiba kasi mama baka siku ile mimi natoka hospitali tikaasa kupanga mambo ya <coughs> ya amani na kila mtu ilirithika na ni baada ya mwaka saba hiyo ile kitu ilifanya ni pandilike hii vita kama angekuwa hii vita kweli kijana yangu na ni mtu alisoma angekufa hapana mimi nikikuwa kiwete sai the third entry point which we used to as a diocese was the connect activities called boarding schools as a diocese and as an office we helped the community to build boarding schools and these boarding schools were not just normal boarding schools we call them inter ethnic boarding schools whereby the children of samburu and pokot were able now to study together and spend a night in a one under one roof We have got uh, 50 people from the Pokot community and uh, the others are from Samburu community. And it is very important because uh, they are learning together. I can't number three because you want them to eh? go back to the passage. And uh, we have uh, the intervention of Catholic mission through the headship of uh, Bishop Virgilio Pante. This place was just like a battlefield. People were fighting because of cattle wrestling. They talked with people, and then later they built a dormitory here, peace dormitory. That is boys' peace dormitory, and we have uh, girls' peace dormitory. Samani atukwa na amani, tulukwa tunapigana na wapokote. Lakini za hizi Mungu ametusaidia tuko na amani, tunashirikiana na wenzetu. Niko na marafiki wengi kwa hii shule, kwa Pokot na Waturkana. Lakini na watu wa Katoliki wametusaidia, wametujengea madoms, tunalala pamoja na wenzetu. 
tunashirikiana pamoja tunakula pamoja tunasoma pamoja tunatembeleana tunaenda kwa kwa baba tunaenda kwa kwetu from the interaction between the the peoples even the 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 the, the, the parents the parent could be able even to uh, to come here freely without even uh, a theory mimi ni msasi wa hapa siambu niko na mtoto wangu ambaye yuko class 8 sasa tulikuwa tunafurugana na mapokoto hapa mbeleni lakini sasa hizi tuko sawa juu tuko na watoto wa pokoto na tuna watoto wanalala pamoja wanasoma pamoja sasa hizi hatuna shida this is a result of peace that uh, we have gotten and uh, we thank god for that market became a, a, another powerful uh, connector and this market uh, it was a place uh, where by the pokot will come with the animals and sell the animals there the samburus will sell the animals there together and it was that that was the beginning of a, a, a language whereby they can speak when they are trading tunafanya biashara pamoja kwa hivyo amani kuna umuhimu wake kubwa sana wakati sasa hakuna amani unajua atopati tuseme rasmali kutoka account zingine kwa sababu inasuiwa na hii ukosefu ya amani so tunapokuwa na amani kuna hiyo kutangamana pamoja kufanya biashara pamoja na kufanya kazi pamoja fifth was uh, the road connector one the, the road was used for security purposes second road was also used for uh, normal trading the vehicles will be able to move down the to the pokot site and can be able to access the pokot site third the road itself was a peace road and sometimes because when the road construction of the road went far nearer to the pokot or nearer to the samburu they will spend either a night in the side of samburu or spend a night either in the side of pokot so that was the building of the, the beginning of uh, building of uh, trust between these communities situated at the center of the warren communities morijo catholic dispensary remains to be a great connector project of peace Morijo Catholic Dispensary is serving all the three tribes, the Samburu, Pokot, and the Turkana. During that time when there was that real conflict, the frequency of conflicts within a short time, even in a week, we can get about three to four cases. But after the, uh, the peace initiative through the Catholic Diocese of Maralal, now the incidences has reduced even to one in a year, or even in a year, sometimes we don't get any uh, conflict. Sustaining peace and enjoyment of its fruits has always been a collective responsibility. We work with the government and especially the branch of Peace Corps which is a branch of the administration police doing peace building. We've been able to work with other churches uh, through an interfaith uh, interaction and uh, working together with the community. Mimi ukiwa mchungaji nilisimama na wachungaji wote wa East Pokot tukaita CIPC Dance of Maral wakaitikia vizuri sana kwanza wakanipatia pikipiki ya kushukulika kukimbia kufanya hiyo monitoring vile vile walitoa pesa tutumie ile mbinu ya wapokot wanatumianga wakati wanafanya suluhisho ya mambo wakati mambo mbaya sana tunanua ngombe ya pokot so tunachinja ngombe usiku wanachinja wanakula usiku na wanaongea usiku yote yakona kulala asubuhi saa moja kanisa tunamuka na kuomba na alafu sasa wao wanatoa resolutions yao asubuhi so wakati mambo imekuwa mzuri ndio tunaita wasamburu tunaita wapokot na wanakuja tunaongea pamoja 
So ushirikiano ya watu kuja pamoja yeah, ndio inawezesha amani kupatikana. Kuna na changamoto nyingi sana wafugaji katika ile hali ya kutetea mifugo yao. Inawasababisha kuna kuwa na vurugu pale katika eneo ya malisho. Na kupitia project ya Caritas, tukatengeneza kitu tunaita response plan. Tuliusisha village committees ya mambo ya amani. Ambo sana sana Caritas imewapatia mafunzo kwa mda mrefu. Wamejidhirisha kwamba ni watu ambao na ukakamavu katika mambo ya amani. Hatuwezi sema kwamba sisi kama serikali, kuu tuna suluhisho. Tumeona kwamba suluhisho ya kudumu ni sisi kama viongozi ambao tumewakilishwa hapa tufuate ule mfano ambao katika swama kuimarisha zile village committee za amani. Wao ndo wako pale mashinani wanajua haswa nini kinasababisha vurugu. Tumefurahishwa na vile ambavyo Caritas wameweza kufanya kazi. Na pia kuna mambo ambayo tungependa hata washikada wale wengine wakija waweze kujifunza mambo mawili matatu kutoka kwao kanisa wamefanya jukumu kubwa kuleta amani especially in peace meeting tena wakati tunataka kufikia watu ile wako na msoso eh e, wananisaidia na mambo ya transport every village iko na msa ile amani inasimamia tuko na wasee ya amani upande yote ya pokoto upande ya samburu hata kama iko uwisi wasee ndio watafuatilia hakuna haja mimi niite askari au nifanye namna gani our role remains only a facilitatory role to facilitate these processes and the community take a center stage in terms of determining their destiny Peace building is a passion. It's not just like employment or anything else. And to do peace building, you need to engage your brain and the heart together. I've worked with people who are warlords. Nilikuwa murani kweli. Hata kama mkutano iko, lazima hata kama ni usiku saa ngapi mpaka nimfurie. Waibe niko ndani. Niko na research hapa. Niko tokese hapa. Mwenyezi Mungu amenilinda. Na sasa hizi vile tuko kuna kikundi eh, kweli inaendelesha amani. Kanisa la Katoliki tunganisha toko Turkana naye tukaungana. Imetusaidia sana. Tumeelewa tunafanya nini. Sasa watoto wangu watatu wako shule. Sasa hizi ndio nimeona ile 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 maneno ilikuwa nafanya ilikuwa ya pu ilikuwa ya pusi. Tumesema asante. I see this as the greatest success when you change one world to a peace builder and then transform those communities who are just victims, who are victims of the situation. But now they are actors, they are actors and they determine their destiny. They say what they want and that is the greatest change. That is the new dawn that we are looking at within our strategic plan. Don't use force. Use love, use respect. The non-violence, this magic word, non-violence, is the key to peace. Happy are the peacemaker. Happy are the meek. The message of Jesus is the key of the success.